What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. I'm High Priestess The Oracle, AKA The Oracle, and I'm back with another video. Thank you guys for your likes, comments, shares, and subscribes. I really appreciate you guys. Um, we're gonna get started with our Midday Vibe session. Welcome back to your Midday Vibe session. And I hope you guys are doing wonderful out there, okay? So these messages may or may not resonate with you, but take what does and leave the rest. We're gonna get started. Um, this channeling is going to um, talk a lot about the closing of a cycle here, okay? Um, a karmic contract has ended, is what I'm hearing, okay? All right, so let me get to shuffling for you guys so we can get started because a cycle has definitely closed, okay? And that karmic contract is coming to an end. If it hasn't ended already, that, that actual contract with the karmics um, will close out. It might've closed out recently, like yesterday, or it may be closing out tonight. This might be that final round for some of you, just to close it. Like the, the, the karmics have been defeated, obviously, but you know they're still, uh, ooh, coming in. Wow. Knight of Pentacles. Guys, you saw how that card flipped? That's the overall energy. What did I say? Some energies are still coming in. There's somebody still coming into play. Knight of Pentacles. This is somebody that is younger than you. Not, not by much, not by far, but younger, okay? <clears throat> All right? So somebody's coming in to bring you an offer. And they're trying to make a, a solid offer with you. Divine masculines, this is for you out here. Okay, maybe some of you divine feminists may be going through this as well. But someone is coming in to give you a solid offer. And it's a, and it's a male, okay? It could be a brother, I'm hearing. A brother, a brother. Okay, so it could be someone in your family. So let's get started. Okay, what else can we... Okay. Let's see, something has happened here. Hermit. Okay, well, first and foremost, I want to get more on this hermit energy because I feel like you saw something. You saw this brother doing something here, all right? And I feel like it shocked you, it scared you. You were alone when you saw this. That's why the hermit car is here. You were alone, but you also heard something, okay? Let's see. We have the Queen of Wands. The Queen of Wands was involved, karmic, okay? There was a karmic. This person is karmic. Also, there um, you're dealing with a steel. You're dealing with the karmic feminine here, that is up to no good. All right, let's see. Oh, and I want to point out when you guys saw this Knight of Pentacles hit the fire over here, my incense. This person was doing magic, and you found out about it. Yep. All right, let's keep going. A sibling, a brother. Ten of Pentacles. This is all about money. This is all about money in a family, in a household here. All right, I wanna clarify with a different deck here, Spirit. I wanna clarify this 10 of Pentacles, please. Wow. Um, guys, first I wanna say a love connection has ended. The lovers is in reverse. Um, there's a love connection that is ended between you and several other people in your family. This is specific for someone out there who was dealing with molestation or childhood wounds or they were wounded early and the entire family was wounded. Brother, sister, every, everybody who's involved. Like you, Divine Masculines, may have had sexual relations with your brother here and they're coming in to make an offer because they don't want this love situation to end. Okay, for some of you, it, was a, it could have been a, a same-sex type situation. But like I said, this is family-oriented. This, this, is, this is karmic, a karmic family that you've completely um, severed ties with. Let's see what else. Clarify this Ten of Pentacles, lovers in reverse. We have the Ten of Pentacles here again. The Ten of Pentacles is here twice. Okay, let me show you guys. If I can, yeah, there we go. Okay. All right. Oh, <laughs> put the wrong card there. Sorry. Okay. So we have the Ten of Pentacles that came out. So you saw somebody here. You saw something. Look, this is you back here, Divine Masculine. They don't even know that you saw them. Now you saw a family. It wasn't just this brother that was shocking. That was that that shocked you. 
All right, because if you haven't seen this yet, you're getting ready to. And you probably have. I believe it. Look, and you saw them doing magic. You saw a mother here. The Queen of Wands was here. Okay, karmic. This is a karmic mother. All right, this is karmic all day long. But you saw them doing magic to keep money. And you heard them chanting. Let's clarify something here. What else with the, uh, with the Ten of Pentacles? We have the Sun card. Yep, you were well aware that there was more than one person involved in your demise with all this spell work that was being done to you. Okay, I see that now. Let's go. Oh, death card. Major Arcana, you, uh, you ended this. You ended this. Like, it's over. Like, this is, this is completely over here. Like, whatever, whatever type of love triangle this was in this family, this karmic family, these people were doing magic to bind you to each other. Like, oh, you're my boyfriend, you're my girlfriend. Like, no, I'm your mother, I'm your brother, I'm your father, I'm your sister. No, that's not how this goes. And you see that now because you are awakened, okay? You're not going back through that succubus energy shit no more. Excuse my language. It's over. It's done. Like, this is sad. Wow. Okay, we have the judgment card and the sun card. Two more major arcanas. We got the lovers out here, major arcana. We got the death card. We have the judgment. Okay, Archangel and the sun card. Archangel Gabriel blew that horn, honey, and woke you up. And you became enlightened because the sun card is here twice. Okay? All right, look. You became enlightened that there were more than one person involved. And you saw it for yourself. Maybe you already knew this, but you had to see it for yourself, I believe. Okay? <clears throat> You had to see it for yourself. Let's keep going. Let's clarify the judgment and the sun card. Let me see. Let me use another deck here. All right, here we go. Wow. Let's see. Um, we have the three of pentacles here. We have the seven of cups. We have the ace of swords. We have the five of pentacles. Ten of Swords, oh my God, <clears throat> and the Four of Pentacles. Okay, so this, this is what I'm seeing here. Yep, you saw everybody working together as a team with the Three of Pentacles here, and they were all doing spell work. Seven of Cups, Ace of Swords, you saw everything. Okay, you got truth and clarity. With this Five of Pentacles, guys, you saw them cutting themselves here. You saw people drawing blood. They were trying to, they were chanting and, you know, dealing with, with all kind of smoke and fire and all kind of things here. And they were cutting themselves because they didn't want to be broke. And you heard them, you know, chanting, you know, oh my God, Ten of Swords. Yes, you heard all of this because look, and you saw this. I'm, I'm looking, oh my God, guys, hold up. You saw this. Look at this person's eyes down here. You saw them hurting themselves, stabbing themselves, pricking themselves, doing all kind of stuff, doing rituals. Everybody was in on your demise. Everybody wanted you out. For some divine feminists, I'm hearing, somebody wanted you out. They wanted to, they, 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 they did not, they wanted to get you down, so far down into your, your root chakra to keep you bounded to your old ways that they were doing stuff to, to doing rituals to do that. They were stabbing you in the back. Look, all for this, to hold on to your money, four of pentacles. And you see all this smoke coming out? Oh, yeah, they, you, you saw them doing fire, smoke magic, candle magic. Look at all these candles. There was a lot of candles burning, okay? You might have saw this in a basement or some room in your home, but either way, um, you saw them doing something very dirty. And let me tell you, I'm still skeptical about this knight of pentacles up here, okay? Ooh, Hmm. Okay, let's keep going. Okay, so Divine Masculine. We have the Nine of Swords in the past position. And we have the Chariot in the present position, okay? Divine Masculine, what happened here is that recently, I believe recently, this is this has taken place, okay? But I want you to be careful of somebody in your environment. Um, you couldn't sleep. You could not sleep. You could not think. You were trying to figure out a way of how to get up out of there. So the next day, you did with the chariot here. Okay? You left. Let's see. Let's clarify. I'm going to use... Okay. Yeah, I'll use that. All right. Okay. Here we go. Let's clarify this uh, nine of swords in the chariot. 
you got the fuck away. Excuse my language. Look, you woke up the next morning, or for some of you, you got up with this three of wands and the eight of pentacles here, and you traveled. You got up right at the wee morning of the hours, because I believe you were up all night watching these people and making sure that you didn't cross their path, okay? And you got up and went to work. And you also got up and went to work on something. Sorry, guys. That totally caught me off guard. <laughs> okay. So, let's clarify that. Let's clarify the three of, um, three of wands and the eight of pentacles. Yeah. Let's see. Yep, you hopped in your vehicle here. This, this, this is the ship card in the magnifying glass. Okay, so what you did was you did get up, you did go, you sailed off, you left fast as hell. Okay, I'm just going to say that. And there's documents here that you went to go take care of. The fine print. All right, you went to go handle some business. So Divine Masculine, what you ended up doing was cutting these people off financially. That's what you did. You got up to cut everybody off in this doggone family financially here. Mother, brother, father, everybody. This Knight of Pentacles is an earth sign too, by the way. Your brother could be an earth sign here for some of you. Mm-hmm, a Taurus, maybe. Mm-hmm. Let's, okay, let's see what else. Yeah, you did for a home situation. Yeah, so you did go take care of some things for, for uh, matters with the house that you're in. Yeah, you cut them off. We also have, wow, yeah. We have the death card and the ladybug. So you did, you ended it. The death card is here twice, but you you ended a luxurious life, a comfortable life for these people here, right? Okay, because we do have the death card here again. Okay, like I told you, you ended it. You ended it. You completely went berserko on these people. <laughs> okay, let's see what else. You rejected them. Four of cups. Mm-hmm. You let it all go. You, 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 whatever was yours, you're taking back. Whatever payments that you, 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 that was, whatever bills were in your name, yeah. <laughs> you got rid of that. Okay. Let's see. We also have the magician that came out. Okay. The reason why you rejected them is because of the magic that they were doing here. This is, this is ultimately the reason. Yep. The whole time this family had you under a spell to sleep with them, right? So you could, so you could keep giving to them financially. And the last result was like a baby to keep you in that house, to keep you taking care of them. Beautiful energy. Guys, the world card is here. Okay. It's over. The cycle is over, all right? End of a karmic cycle. This is, I mean, end of a karmic contract. Now, this is the karmic contract, all right? That is completely over. All right, so let's move forward, guys. And we're going to touch in on this Knight of Pentacles energy here, all right? Let's see what deck we're going to use here. All right, okay. Okay. Here we go. So what I'm picking up right now, guys, there's something going on here with a brother in your environment, all right? Um, and it's very heavy energy. And I think you need to pay attention to this right now, all right? So let's go. Let me clarify here, guys. Give me one second. Here we go. Here we go, guys. Let's see what's... Oh, Lord, let's see what's going on. Guys... First of all, you have um, the Tower and the Knight of Pentacles in reverse. Now, this there's someone here you've been making offers, okay? You've been giving things to. You, you, you really have. You've been giving this to a brother, a sibling, someone in your house, guys, all right, that you've been giving to. But do you see here? I'm hearing a car payment, car note, car payments. We, we, oh, wow. Okay, so you ended, you stopped payment on a vehicle, on a car for somebody, for this brother. Okay, thank you, Spirit. Thank you, Spirit, guys, for that message. Okay, I'm going to pull another deck here and clarify this for you guys. Give me one second. 
gosh wow oh my god it's over and you see that tower here like this is completely over yeah you stop payment on something on a car payment here for this person they can't go anywhere okay they can't do anything anymore yeah i believe you really trusted and loved this brother okay i really do believe in some way i feel like you don't really care for him much but there's an aspect of you that still loved him in some way and it was only because of the energy of you guys being partners sexually because it was a, a spell okay it was it was it was a wound from your childhood that's what i'm picking up this is all about childhood wounds for you guys out there that you're finally clearing let's clarify the tower and the uh, knight of pentacles i mean yeah mm -hmm. we have wow the page of wands and the two of wands okay your brother this is a younger person this person is younger than you okay and they are hot and heated because i believe they got the message um they got the news here okay and yeah that you made plans to do this that you had you had gone through with your plans here okay let's um let's keep going yeah divine masculine um yeah we have the nine of wands here you were you were abused by your brother look at this two two of you guys are right here on this card i can't make this up this is a sibling that you don't want to be wounded by anymore you don't want to be touched by your brother anymore you're looking away in this nine of wands depiction you're kind of looking away here and because you've been wounded so badly by these people and the person that you really trusted or maybe loved the most was your brother and this person hurt you and you got rid of them. Okay? We have the Six of Cups and the King of Cups here. Divine Masculine, you are leaving the past behind and you don't have any feelings or emotions for this person at all. Not even in that way sexually anymore. Okay, that's over. Let's see what else we got. Okay, guys, um, this person knows they're going to have to go out and get some kind of job or, or whatever. I, I'm hearing that too um, as well. But your brother here, because the several cards came out, and I want you, to, want you to hear me out on this. All right? We have the Wheel of Fortune. This person wants to keep you in the same cycle, but they know your destiny. They know where you're headed. They know you're going towards your divine feminine, first and foremost, okay? You're going towards someone, okay? And they're determined with this Leo strength, right? Strength card. It's all about being strong, determined, right? They're trying to tame the beast, right? Okay, I told you they're trying to tame their sexual energy because they were molested just like you were, all right? With the same people here. But they were... <laughs> This person was just made to do things to you or whatever, okay? And they're moving forward quickly in the chariot, okay? Because they're sad and they're heartbroken, okay? And they're crying. They're crying. This person is in tears. More tears, the death card. Because something is over, okay? It's over, all right? They're, they're fulfilling their wishes here. Fulfilling their wishes, Okay, because they put a lot of, with the Nine of Cups, yeah, it's all about fulfilling their wishes, right? With the uh, Seven of Pentacles, they put a lot of time and effort and energy, toil and labor into your demise here. They even got tarot readings on you, Page of Pentacles, with the family. They also um, pay practitioners. They already knew your future with this all-seeing eye here. Okay, um, and they paid for things, right? So that... Um, You wouldn't have your Ace of Cups because the Ace of Cups is in reverse. You couldn't have a commitment or a relationship, right? They made sure of that. And it was a secret, the moon card. You had no idea your brother was working. Ooh, y'all, go back. I'm telling you, working behind the scenes. Go back and look at a video. It has Cain and Abel on the video, the, on that, on that um, thumbnail. And it was about a brother's shocking revelation. That could have something to do with this. Maybe check it out and see what you guys think, Okay. All right. And they kept this a secret because, you know, they were doing rituals with the family here. Four of Wands. OK, they were all they were involved in your demise here. All right. Your brother has a sexual addiction. He is addicted to you and he is pissed off. I'm hearing um, because he was molested a long time ago. All right. But he's still in a very dark place. OK, 
That's what I'm hearing, guys. Okay, what else do we have here, Spirit? Okay, they're in the Eight of Swords. We have the Eight of Swords. We also have the Eight of Wands. Okay, we have the Ten of Cups. And we also have the Queen of Swords. Guys, this, this your brother here, the sibling, um, this person's in their head thinking about how they're going to communicate to you. Okay, they're going to communicate to you to keep their abundance here. They're going to communicate to you on behalf of the family, the coven, a group of people. Remember, it was a lot of people involved, not just people in your house, but outside of your household. Right, and they're going to stand their ground, queen of swords. Okay, they're coming in. They're going to be very cutting. All right, let's see what else, guys. Beware of this, please. Mm-hmm. This is, um, I'm hearing... This person is going to possibly go through your phone. Um, they're going to try to go through your phone. They're going to try to blackmail you. Okay, so I, 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 I suggest that you be very careful here. This person's in the Nine of Swords. They can't sleep. They, you're depressed over losing you sexually here because they're in the wrong energy. Okay, do you understand? Okay, this is for someone out there, guys. Okay, all right? They're just in the wrong energy and they can't sleep or think. Nine of Pentacles, they still want you for abundance, like I said. And they're going to move forward here with the Six of Swords with the plan, right? Because they want you to choose. The lovers is here. They want you to choose this Queen of Wands. The karmic, okay? They also want you to choose them. They want you to choose the family, okay? And they're wishing here with the Star card for this. Ace of Wands. They want to, look, the reason why they're wishing for this, for this Queen of Wands, like I told you, she's up here, right? Because he wants to help her get pregnant. But with you, though, not by him, by you, Ace of Wands. So some of y'all, somebody is planning some type of trick here, all right? Yep, Empress card, they want to get pregnant. They want this mother to be pregnant, all right? And they feel like it's a burden right now, right? They feel like this whole situation is a burden because you didn't stop payments on everybody. You done walked away. You know what I'm saying? This person is like, no, I, I got y'all back, family. Like this person got the family back. They don't have your back. So I suggest do not call out to him. Do not reach out to him. Okay. You need balance right now. Right. You need to stay balanced. 22. Right. Stay balanced here. Because your soulmate is here. Your divine feminine is here. You guys, your divine masculines are here. But you cannot get to them if someone comes in to sabotage you. Let's go. Oh, I hear childhood. Mentioning this Queen of Wands, guess what we have? Queen of Wands in reverse and the hangman in the upright. Divine Masculine, you're no longer stuck with the Queen of Wands here. Energy, okay? You're, 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 you're no longer bounded to that energy anymore. So you're not going to fall for that. <laughs> so your brother is going to have a hard time getting you to do that. But I, I, I'm going to warn you and caution you. Walk away from him. What else? Wow. I'm hearing... If somebody's going to go through your phone, blackmail. Look, blackmail. Look what came out, the devil. I told you, this person is still in the wrong energy. They're still pissed off at their childhood. And they're pissed off because, oh, he's not going to take care of me anymore. He's not going to pay my car note. And I hear you possibly got rid of the car. Why did he get rid of the car, spirit? I want to... Oh. I wanted to... The clover is in reverse. This is why you got rid of the vehicle, Divine Masculine. Because the clover is all about luck, reward, good fortune, you know, unexpected rendezvous, things like that. Because you're not having a fling with this person anymore. It's in reverse. Wow. Wow. Powerful. You're not having a fling and you also don't want that bad luck attached to you. Okay? So. What else do we have? We have, like I said, we had the devil that came out. This person's still toxic, still karmic. They're having a wake-up call with the judgment card here. All right, they're having a sheer awakening. That's the divine. And the reason being is because this person, they have to choose, right? But they're still choosing to be destructive here, all right? They're still choosing to be in the wrong energy, okay? Because the Knight of Cups shows up, yep. Like I told you, for some of y'all, this could be a same-sex relationship that y'all you were in, right? Like I said, it could have been also with a brother, a family member. Yep. This person is a little bit younger than you, but they had a fling with you. 
Okay, they were, they were messing with you, so they can't let go of the addiction. The demon still has them. But you, you divine masculine and divine feminist, you guys are not under the spell anymore. All right? This person is wishing with the star card. Okay? Wishing, hoping that they could have what they had with you in the past. Six of cups, like when you guys were kids. Okay, I'm hearing childhood children. Okay? All right? And they're going to come in fighting for this five of freaking ones. They're going to cause conflict. They're going to cause tension. I'm just telling you right now, because this person is not mentally stable. Two of swords is here. <laughs> They're in two minds. They're mentally ill right now. Okay. Because they are choosing not to heal. They're choosing to still give in to the queen of wands, her demands. Also a father, a father is working really, really hard with your brother right now. He's been a part of this too. Okay. And the father, <laughs> I'm telling y'all, just be aware that if you have not gone through this, some of you will, but some of you have already, but this person is coming back. The brother is coming back for blood. Do you hear me? Okay. They're coming back because they think you love them so much. Oh, I know how to get them back. I know what to do, Pops. Well, this is what we're going to do. Hey, Mom, I know what we're going to do. Yeah, this person is planning your shit right now. Okay. The devil is here. The devil and the three of pentacles. Yep. Everybody is working together. What did I tell you? The devil and the three of freaking pentacles. The three of pentacles is here on the board somewhere else. <laughs> it's so many cards. Oh, here it is. Here it is. Yeah, look at this. Everybody's working together, divine masculines. Okay. For some of you out there, a lot of you are trying to get to your soulmates. Okay. A lot of you are trying to get there. But this is why you're having a hard time because somebody's still in the wrong energy. The devil shows up twice on the board. They're trying to get you bounded back into that succubus energy of having sex. I want you to look down here, guys, at this devil card. Do you see all these people, these entities? Look at all those entities down there. Look at everybody. Oh, my gosh. This is filth. Filth. I'm hearing filth. Filth. Yeast infections, bacterial infections. Um, I'm hearing all kind of stuff that, that y'all have accumulated because of this succubus energy at one point in time. Divine Masking, you don't have it now, but this brother is dealing with it because he got it from the mother. Wow. Oh my God. Y'all, that was a channeling for someone out there. So this, pro this person is pissed off because, gosh, they, they still want to try to make this work. Everybody wants to try to make this work. But my suggestion here is, woo, to keep moving. Okay, let's see what, what you're going to do. Oh yeah, you are. Knight of Cups in reverse and the Three of Wands. Yeah, Divine Masculine, you are, you're rejecting you're rejecting this and you're traveling at a distance with this three of wands. You're going far. You're, you're leaving. You're leaving. Okay? We also, Divine Masson, have a, a father in the mix because the emperor came out. What did I say? A father. Your father, older guy. Kind of chubby-like. Not real tall, not real short, but has cheese chubby. That's what I'm hearing. Older guy. In his 50s, probably. Okay? Oh, my God. And this person wants justice. They want, they, they want justice. Wow. You guys, this has been a powerful message. Um, Divine Masculines, you know, I know this has been Divine Masculine re entirely, but that I have been picking up some feminine energies possibly for some of you. But you guys are dealing with a, a Taurus, a Leo. Um, you, you're dealing with um, earth signs, fire signs here. Uh, water, almost every element is here, but this brother has is an earth sign. The father, he might be he might be a fire sign. He might be a fire sign. He might have Aries in his chart. Might be okay. He might be a Leo. The mother is a uh, she is representing here um, a earth sign, Taurus. So you might have several different earth signs in your environment that's uh, in this household. Okay. And I'm hearing uh, the only reason why you were addicted to sex is because they were working roots on you. And it was a secret agenda that they always had, okay? So just know that a lot of this is happening karmically, guys, for you. Um, because it was time to get out of this karmic contract. This was a karmic soulmate contract that needed to end, okay? And there's one last round coming for some of you. A, a family member is rushing in, okay, to give you an offer. And they're going to make an offer, but they are in the wrong energy. I told you, this person is in the devil energy here, okay? 
they're they're not quite right they're not screwed on quite tight okay and divine masculines you're not interested um anymore in uh being a part of this family okay you're not you're not you're just not okay that is over that is over and freaking done do you hear me over and freaking done so i hope that this message resonates with some of you and i hope this message helps you guys out there who are possibly um going through a situation like this because um this situation is very very serious and they're telling me to please 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 give you this warning to beware of this energy because this person is coming in to try you at the very last minute but um just stay on your toes Stay awakened, stay vigilant, and I love you guys. Thank you so much for tuning in to your Midday Vibe session, and I hope this message gets to someone in time. Love you.